It's not working out, maybe it's the chemistry, it's time to break Hello viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel Did you miss me? <laughs> yeah, welcome back So, today we want to talk about mental health As the world is evolving, things are happening People are going through stress, difficulties And this is the time that you need to be kind Be kind with your words be kind with your action. People are going through a lot. You see, as I was coming to the studio this morning, I happened to meet someone. The person was actually talking to himself. <laughs> and at the second thought, I was looking at him. Maybe he was on APs or something, but the truth is he was having conversation with himself. People are really going through a lot. You may be working with someone who is hurting, but having a smiling face, and you may not know that's why you need to be kind. Be kind with your action, actions, be kind with your words, be kind with what you do to others. So what then is mental health? Mental health has to do with behavioral, emotional, cognitive well-being of a person. A person has to be psychologically balanced and people can also say that um, um, mental health has to do with the absence of mental disorder. You may be right. <laughs> Whatever this, um, definition you give it, you are right. But it has to do with a state of balance. Emotionally, you're balanced. Psychologically, you're balanced. So whatever definition you can give to it, you have it. But then, let's look at it again. So people go through a lot of things. Emotional stress. People go through depression. That is part of it. And you may even be in the office space with someone who is going through this thing. And you may not know. You know, I had a friend who lost um, a relative and not even a relative, someone very close, a family member. And she has been laughing, you know, playing with everyone in the office. No one knew what she was going through. You know, she spent her salaries on that relative. And unfortunately, the person died. And, you know, she went through a lot. But here she was playing, laughing with any, everyone. So there was a day where um, they celebrated Mother's Day. I think it was the mom that died. They celebrated Mother's Day. And I noticed that, you know, when you're working with someone, you also have to check out and look for others. You, if you see that person that has always been lousy, playing around, all of a sudden withdraws. There is something. You need to find out. That is why you are there. That is why you are also in that space with that person. You know, I noticed that she withdrew when they were celebrating Mother's Day in the office. She withdrew and that's me. I'm not saying I'm a perfect being, but I had to go to her and I actually ask her, what's the issue? Why are you withdrawn and why are you not talking to others? Why are you not celebrating mother, motherhood? What's going on? She came to me and said, all is not well, that she lost her mom. I was, I was, are you serious? I was shocked. Because there's someone that is always lively. There's someone that you may not even know what she's going through. So why, why are we here? Why are, is, what is the essence of this video? Just to tell you out there that you should be kind. Be kind to people. It may not, the words you give or you say to someone may not mean anything to you. But trust me, it means everything to the other person. Before you speak, think twice. Will it hurt this person? How will the person react? If you're a Christian, the Bible says, do unto others what you wish others do unto you. The world is tough. Early in the morning, you hear of someone committed suicide or someone died, someone did this, jump into um, Tenland Bridge, jump over into, you know, a lot of things. People kill themselves. But then, hey, you don't have to terminate your life because you're going through stuff. The fact that you're going through something does not mean others are not going through it. You know, there was um, this proverb or a bee, what do you call it? A proverb, uh, a story that a king once told everyone, bring your problem so that each and everyone can exchange their problems. People came with Ghana must go and someone that was always complaining, he came with a handbag of problems and when he saw other people, so he was like, wow, <laughs> let me carry my problem and go. People are also going through stuff. So the fact that you see others being able to carry their own stuff does not mean that their load is light. It's maybe heavier than yours. But then again, they, they have seen life as it is. They've accepted their faith and they've accepted life the way it is. But do you know the funny thing about this life? I don't know if you two, you've been thinking about this thing. The funny thing about life is, after all this struggle, after all these trials, 
we all will die. <laughs> nobody, <laughs> absolutely nobody leaves this place alive. So then you have to sit back and rethink. If you say you want to kill yourself because you're going through one problem or the other, there are people who have passed through that same problem and they're out of it, they're testifying today. So you need to protect your mental health. You have to. You don't need you don't need to put yourself in a situation that whatever someone says or does to you gets to you. Leave this world as if you are in the world. People will come with their troubles, people will come with them. A lot of problems. People will even say or do things that will hurt you, but hey, don't let it go to you. Don't, don't let it, don't. Just take it as a normal thing. Words are transient. After talking, I know you will get it. It's just like a bullet. It, it hurts. But then again, protect your mental health. So when I talk about the emotional aspect of it, you know, some people are in a relationship and all of a sudden someone calls it off. I know it hurts, but then <laughs> you don't know what God has actually saved you from. You may not know. God has saved you from something that you cannot tell. So if, if such happens, take life the way it is. Let it go. Don't allow it get to your mind. Don't allow it disturb your mental health. Don't. Just let it go. So whatever you're going through, this is, I'm not here to motivate you, but I'm just here to tell you the reality. I'm a realist. Things happen. If I also tell you the story of what I have gone through or is going through, you too, you also testify that we're in the world. There is nobody. Even the rich also cries. So you have nothing to worry about. Protect your mental health is very important. Protect it with all your might protect your health so thank you very much i know that you've gained one or two things from our topic today so from next time uh don't worry let me not tell you what will happen next time so thank you very much viewers and always remember to like share and comment i'm always here to read from you thank you very much see you next time it's not working now maybe it's the chemistry it's time to break